hey guys welcome back to the channel and i'm back with another video so in this one i'm going to share some substance painter resources with you and all these resources are going to be free to use so if you're using substance painter then open it and here you'll see this icon which says substance 3d community assets and if you click here it's going to open a page in your browser so log in with your credentials and uh, here you can download all these materials smart materials decals atlases 3d models filters and uh, generators as well so if you want to download any of these smart materials or the materials just go into this section and uh, scroll through all these options and here you can download all these uh, materials so you just click here and it's going to open this page and it's going to show you some of the previews of this material and to get this material just click on this download icon and it's going to download this material in your pc so there are two ways to download these materials let's try both of them so i'm going to download one more so i'll just download a metal material So here we have this rust material. I'm going to download this. So just download. So there are two ways to install your materials. Uh, first one is just select this and drag and drop this in here. And it's automatically going to assign the asset type here, which says smart material. And you can go here and import it in your assets. And here you'll see this material right here and the other way is you click on this icon and uh, go to add resources go to the folder where your assets are downloaded and select that and open it define it as uh, material so this is our base material so just change it to base material so most of the time substance painter is gonna automatically recognize the asset type so you don't have to change anything here and let's add this to your library and import now we have both materials here let's uh, open a sample and try these materials we just downloaded so i'm going to just delete this and let's try this rust material so select it and drag and drop in the layers and as you can see this looks pretty good and you can change all the parameters here so you can change the normal intensity if it looks too bumpy and you can also change the scale of these grunges like this and you can change all these parameters and play with the settings to get some different results i'm going to delete this and check my other materials so let's go to the smart tail and here we have this fine fiber wood we just downloaded so select it and drag and drop here And now we have this fantastic wood material you can use in your projects and the same way you can download all these assets uh, such as these filters and decals and the generators just download them and drag and drop in your substance painter and you can also download the 3d models that substance library have So just scroll through all these assets and download whatever you like 
and install them in your library and uh, start using them in your projects so i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did then make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you are new i'll see you in the next one thanks for watching